Hey guys, what's up? My name's Danny, aka Thriftfish. I'm an online fashion reseller. I sell on Poshmark, eBay, and Mercari, and today I am bringing you a good old Goodwill haul. A slight story time. I did source three separate times this week, and two of the times I traveled a little out of my way, probably 30 to 45 minutes one way both times um, to try to go down to the stores that I'm used to having the better quality items and just more things to find and I didn't actually end up getting a whole lot uh, either of those trips so that was kind of a little like defeating I was not feeling great and of course Today I decide to go just over to the Goodwill that's right next to where I live. I could walk there. Uh, they generally don't have the best stuff and I get discouraged when I go there, but it was quick and easy so I popped over there this morning and of course uh, I found a lot of good stuff. So I'm going to share that with you today. So let's, you know, without further ado, let's just go ahead and, and hop into it. We're going to hop into it. Uh, <laughs> okay, here we go. Um, and some of it is bread and butter. It's not like, I didn't, there are some good pieces in here, but, um, some of it's also bread and butter, like this loft, uh, blazer. It's size small. It's really soft and it is animal print. So I feel like that does well. And it was half price. So orange was the color of the week. So it was half off. So that's a pretty good price. Blazers are not terribly expensive at my Goodwills. <clears throat> there is wool in this yeah so it felt like there was something nice so that's good I have mentioned this uh, recently but I've been picking up a lot more plus-size items and this was included this is a pair of Lane Bryant uh, mid-rise joggers size 14 16 they are new with tags they have the tag of $9.99, but they are orange, so they're half price, so they're $4.50, which I was willing to pay for a pair of cute new with tags, Lane Bryant plus size joggers. This I could not believe. Now you can see the Marshalls tag on this, but this is a Madewell size 2X velvet, like got pretty like sleeve, bubble sleeve detail. I don't know if that's what that is size 2x new with tags made well velvet dress and they didn't mark it up which they mark almost all of new with tags items up so I don't know but I definitely snagged it it was regular price uh, which is still kind of expensive dresses run a little high in this area but I was willing to pay for it here's another pair of really pretty plus size pants I've picked up a few pairs of bold, bright floral pattern pants from this brand before. They are Eloquy, size 26. These usually sell pretty fast, so I was happy to pick those up. There's another half price item, and it's the only reason I picked it up. I looked at this another time, but I decided it wasn't worth it at the time. It's a J. Crew size small. It's a pretty basic hoodie, like navy blue hoodie, but it has cute like bell ruffle sleeve detail so and like I said it was half price with the orange tag so it came home with me this was a nice find I was really excited about this one this is a nice um what size is this this is eight plus which I don't know what that means but this is by the brand NYX which is one of those underwear brands you see on Instagram as far as I know uh, I recognized it by because I think I've seen that ad and when I looked them up on Poshmark it looks like they go anywhere from 20 to 35 dollars maybe more so uh, I definitely threw that one in I have been picking up a lot of this outdoor brand lately because I like it it's Prana this is a size large tank top and I think it's twist back, I guess it is. Um, but it's soft and it feels pretty new, so I do like to pick up Prana. I don't know why I'm taking it off the hanger. <laughs> Next is just this pretty soft newer tag, size small, athleta dress. Nothing crazy about it, I just really liked it and it's in really good condition. 
I like to pick up the newer tag athleta. I like to pick up a lot of athleta in general, but especially the newer tag items. This is also Prana. These are kind of like, they have a texture to them, but they're just a, like kind of a stretchy legging, I don't know if you'd call it moto, but it's got the, you know, it's got some detail there. They're very stretchy. Um, here you can see Prana size medium. They have the little logo on the back. So these are nice. And this was really exciting. I've never found this brand before and was surprised to see it in my store. I've never sold it before, but I looked up comps and I liked what I saw. So this is Arcteryx, size medium, and it's just this little like half zip. It's got a zipper on the side, it's like a little logo there, it's like a little skeleton, like a lizard skeleton logo. I don't know, but it's cool. Uh, I'm excited to see what this will go for and list it. That's it for clothes. I bought three pairs of shoes and three bags. I rarely pick up bags unless they're like vintage coach or vintage Dooney all weather leather because they're very recognizable to me, but I did go ahead and pick up three bags, which is, all right, we'll see. You'll, yeah. This one was probably my riskiest just because I'm not, I've never been in the world of like Michael Kors stuff. And I do think that this is missing like a shoulder strap, but it's a nice leather Michael Kors satchel that they didn't price up. It's only like eight or $9. It's Michael Michael Kors, so it's not like higher end, but it's got the branding on the bottom. And so, yeah, it looks like it, I could get 40, 45 bucks for this. So I'm not mad. We'll give it a shot. This is potentially very exciting. Uh, I have never found a real one of these, so I'm a little, always a little wary when it comes to Longchamp, but you know, I'll do my research. This was very inexpensive. I don't know, they're just deceiving, but. So I don't know if this is real or what style this is. I've never sold Longchamp really, but it has a tag inside of it. It has something there, and there's also a, oh yeah, it has like the actual like retail tag. So again, potentially very exciting. Little lightweight long shelf. And this one's my favorite, just because I like this brand. I don't know what it's worth. I didn't check comps, but again, it wasn't too expensive, but look how pretty this, Pour La Victoire leather bag is. It's so pretty. Yeah, it's just a nice leather tote. It looks like it's almost never been used. I'm trying to see if there's, oh my gosh, yeah, it's gorgeous on the inside. So yeah, I was shocked to, to see this. I mean, usually I don't have any luck with bags at the store because they mark them all up if they're worth anything. And I don't find a lot of really good quality like off the grid bags there. Sometimes, sometimes, like this time, not all the time. Okay, and I got three pairs of shoes. First, I got these because, you know, they were a good price and I think the style is in. They're just uh, Zara, Zara Basic, but they're a cute like wood clog heel sandal with the, I, I'm assuming it's suede, like real suede. I'm never sure of details with Zara. What does it say? Made in Espana. I think it's leather. Yeah, this is leather. Size 40. So I don't know what the conversion is in Zara sizes, but these are cute. You guys know I'm always a fan. Um, this is an interesting heel. It's got like a patent. I don't know. Is this an animal print? Like what is this? I know this has like a specific name, but if you know what the name for this like style is, can you drop it in the comments for me? But these are, hold on, Corks by Corkies. So you guys know I'm a sucker for these. If you've been watching my videos, yeah, I pretty much always pick these up and they were uh, like $7, so. And I got $10 off my purchase today because I had enough points, because I'm a rewards member. <laughs> anyway, last pair of shoes. Again, this is a brand, if you've been watching my videos, you know this is a brand I'm crazy about. And again, $7, <laughs> you bet. 
These are some like brand new, like look like they've never been worn by Onyx. Little booties. So cute. So very excited about these. Very excited about everything I got today. So I hope you liked this haul. Let me know what your favorite piece was down in the down in the comments. Uh, and yeah, uh, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more from me, I would really appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much for being here, and I will see you guys again real soon.